do it. You can break it. I have a couple orange balls at home too, but I got to I don't know. I get a little picky and then I start buying more basketballs and like because they get worn out really fast. some good good three pointers off in the last uh, Wednesday which is what I do shoot threes okay. oh he didn't cross the line yeah he, did. he took one he took the foot in the ball oh are you there. making this the line no he went up here and then he went behind his back because I had to get up <laughs> I had a feeling he was going to make that. He had the right stance. Play basketball. Oh! This man's still getting warmed up here. But I'll still give both of you shit. bad my knee is, man. I threw in the knee pad. I threw the knee pad from the Wednesday. Yeah. I got tripped up. It's like, what's the point of even wearing a knee pad? I mean, if it just goes through it. Good thing you got that shit in the backyard, that wave thing. Yeah. That's awesome for after basketball. No, you gotta make three. Three? Yeah, you three. Yeah. Three or the foul line, your choice. No, I'm saying you gotta make three in a row. Yeah, three. To get the check. Yeah, I got that in the backyard. That thing right there, after a game of hoop, or even just in general for your knee, yeah, is godsend. It's very good, especially for like root <laughs> bumps and bruises and stuff like that. Uh huh. Those things are incredible. You can just fill them up with hot water and run them like hot tubs. Yeah, yeah, you could. Zero for me. That's what that is. I gotta get more job. But I get there. It takes me a couple games to get done. Yeah, me too. I guess been playing so much recently. My muscle memory is starting to come back. That's right. Uh, 
close between you guys. I got nothing. Then again, I'm just screwing around shooting right now. Yeah, me too. I'm just taking breeze to get it going. No wind, so I always tell the team, I'm like, man, I'm like, you should come Sunday mornings because that's because everyone's like, win, win, win. Well, there's no wind on Sunday morning, so and third it's place, we have LA, LA, Wednesdays are all go, go, you can do it, Ellie. Go, go, go. Justin's right behind them. Mom's taking the lead. You haven't lost too much touch. That's good. Welcome good. to the winner. That's good to see. And you know, even by, you know, when they ever kind of team, even by team boat, dude, here you go. Oh. by team boat, it's like the majority of guys even want him on the team. Because it's just, he's always arguing with people and shit. People have to on the team vibe well and get along, you know. You always get one guy who doesn't want to do that. And it's like, well, then go. I'm sure next year some of those guys that aren't on my team will try to form their own team, some clown ass fucking team. And then we'll be we'll just kick their ass, so it won't matter. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's a moonshot. <laughs> Oh, come on, man. <laughs> the accuracy is there. I hit the rim. I just can't switch that shit. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's all right, because right, this is just like warm up for me. I was just kind of throwing them up here. I can come, I can actually, actually uh, do layups and stuff too, but if I want to play defensively, I gotta work on the three. go man yeah was it you know that big kid that it's almost as well he's closer to hiding you he forces it way too much when he's up under the net. He's still learning. Yeah, yeah, he's still learning. He's he wants to play like in a year for us, a year and a half. If we if we practice with him right, to turn him into a killer player under the net. Yeah, I'm getting him right. I got him under my wing. Yeah. He's just got to <laughs> stick in the dojo with me. He learns. I mean, every time I play him, he does something. I teach him. Yeah. So I know he's learning. He's just still finding how physical he could be. Because he plays football. Yeah, he's so football. Like, so he, he, he's too physical right now. Oh. And, and, and needs to work on a little bit of finesse stuff. Yeah, he got that right. But he, like I said, he's young, so he can learn. Yeah, Some of these guys get set in their ways, like in the league. They only play one way. They're not open-minded to anything else, you know. I try to be a well-rounded player, you know, little defensive, little offensive. I definitely like to set up plays. Oh, nice move. Oh.
it is. <laughs> Same <laughs> Oh man. I try not to hit my players <laughs> and play clean just because the refs in the league are real anal about clean play, you know. Oh I will get you! <laughs> I got you better in the wing. You gotta adjust oh. for it. Yeah, yeah. You really do. But I'll tell you what, this is still... What? Oh. <laughs> oh my god, finally. <laughs> Praise the Lord. No, you, you oh, did free throw. I did free throws. I'm just taking it from here. Oh. But threes are good too. Yeah, it helps me with my overall jumper just getting stuff together. Like I haven't taken a shot inside yet. Oh no, the lay on the side of the airport. Yeah. Sometimes I'm hook shots work good. from him once he's got it. Unless you foul, but I don't do that because that just means more points, so. <laughs> more free throws. Me and him have some intense 21 games. Once I get warmed up though, it gets on, man. It's on. Yeah, you see how fast That's like your rebounder in the league, I mean, and you're going to either expect me to push it or hit the rim. So I think my players can adjust for that a little bit too. Because I got a pretty accurate shot. I just need to get it more uh, zeroed in uh, between the rim, not bouncing it. Bank shots work. Oh, there you go. Well, you hustled. Cut in and you hustle. That was good. There you go. Eight, eleven, four. Yeah. Yep. Four. He's 
got an accurate shot too. I think in the league, I think in the league, they're gonna have to be keeping an eye on both of us when it comes to the threes. Oh. In the league, honestly, I'm gonna be right there, 15 to 18 feet. Mm -hmm. That's where I'm gonna be. I'll be around where James is. Nobody ever covers me in the league. I only take three. They in never the do. First in the fourth quarter. The only time they start covering me is when I start making threes, and they try to fucking double team me. Because I don't want me making more threes. But that always leaves one of my guys open, so it's like let him double cover me. Get in there. Get in there. <laughs> Beautiful morning out. Oh yeah. This rim is playing a day. Uh, like if this was single rim, I know a lot of these would have went in. But she's making me earn it, and I like it. Double teaming on me, man. Woo! That's some exercise right there. 11, 11, uh, 5. Yeah. I don't have enough. <laughs> I need to make some threes here. Of course. <laughs> oh man. How can he not okay. take advantage of that? You know? Oh. My bad. Live and learn, I guess they say. <laughs> I get it, I get it. You know what amazes me is there's never nobody here playing. Oh yeah. Like what the hell, man? If I grew up here, they would be sick to me. All you'll probably hear is my basketball and my radio. We'd also be like waiting in All line the to play. Where I'd be. <laughs> we'll be waiting in line to play. <laughs> Lost it. Ugh! I hate when that shit happens. I mean, it's so pretty good. Of course it is. Yeah, exactly. Oh! <laughs> I think I put my finger on the ball. A little, little move right there. <laughs> you had to work for that one. 17, 18, 5. Right 
if this ground wasn't so slippery, I could even run faster. Okay. Yeah. I could even run faster, but there's a few slippery areas, man. Yeah, well, they didn't pay the Because I can get speed. I can run three times faster on like a regular sport than I would do. Well, I mean, it got me through the knee pad. It's, it's hot, it's infected, I put any back, you know, it just shaved the whole skin right off. And, and that's with the knee pad, so I gotta get a drink. Yeah, I gotta buy more of that powdered stuff. Yeah, that shit's awesome. It is, it's good for pain. Go on, go under the tree. Here, right <laughs> here. come here. Come here, You just can't, but I mean, a lot of those guys, that just, that just tells you they don't really know how to play. Even if they can shoot, they still don't understand the, uh, you know, the, 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 the oaks wide open, you know, and it's yeah. like, but you're telling me you're the, you are the captain of this team and that team, and you're the point guard, and it's like you are lying to me to impress me, and rather than just, you know, work hard and play hard and get a position that suits you, yeah. rather than play a position you're not good at. So I, I have to be universal because I know what it's like to have a shorthand basketball team and have to play center the whole game, you know. I know what that's like. But given my age and all that stuff, I try to stay half court so I can watch our roof. Yeah. But sometimes, man, when I got two, three guys coming at me, that's really hard to defend. One guy, two guys, yeah. I can kind of slow down the momentum of the play for my guys to do that. But I try, not, I try to make sure, like, I think, I think when we play our league, I think we need to all time then to have two defensemen right in this area so that yeah. we have somebody, two of us can at least get back. Because we have four guys under the hoop, and I'm way in the middle of the court. Yeah. And I got all them guys running it, you know? So defense is something we just, you know, we're gonna have to work on. And we can't, we can't, because you know, you get rid of, rid of the rip rat, and you get guys that actually want to play and win, you know? Yeah. But it's hot as hell out. You know, I gotta buy a better, I'm gonna get a Bluetooth speaker. But I want a bigger one. That I can bring here. Yeah. You know, not something that I can put out a little sound. That way I can play whatever off my MP3 player. Because I got my MP3 player in my truck. Yeah. It's like 4,000 pounds. So, yeah. I can load a bunch of fucking music. Any craft guy, I don't care. It's better than the radio, you know. Yeah. But I could get a Bluetooth speaker here. You could even hook up your. Yeah, I'm ready. Give me a quick, give me one second. Dude, I hate wearing glasses, to be honest with you. 
so my eyes are shot, my eyesight's going, and uh, on top of that, I'm real light sensitive to any kind of light, really, even lamps. Yeah, Marlin played with me uh, for a couple of years, and you know, he was one of our top scorers in the league, believe it or not. I mean, he did quite well per game. And he gets better and better. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I when I play with him in the well, first four games of this season, every game better and better and better. You know, and that's, that's good to see, too, that people improve. You like to see that improvement. As a coach, I love to see it. I like to see my guys grow. Because, I mean, we, you know, when you start a team, you start from scratch, man. It's, uh, I mean, you start from scratch. I went through like 100 guys, just, you know, having them come play and shit. Oh, careful. Oh, what a shot. Put me the same, man. Wednesday, that, that, that guy, that stepfather, that Bobby or whatever, punched me in the nose out of an accident. Yeah. Like, like totally, dude, just straight on. And I kept playing. Like, like I didn't mean to do it. It's like, yeah. <laughs> but I was like, holy shit, man, right in the fucking face like I punched. I'm lucky, like, I didn't have a nose break or something, you know. Because that happens, too, when people hit you like that. Oh, come on. Really? Really? Ugh. Gotta bring it in a little more. bad for a hungover man. The only one you haven't met so far is Adrian. He's in his 30s too. Almost. You know what I'm saying? He's, 
Yeah, he's tall. I, I gotta get that height, man, to get it. Shit behind. <laughs> Holy shit. Nice move. And you're a fan. Wow. See, he improves every day. <laughs> it's like I gotta keep up with him. <laughs> he just shoot the three. But yeah, I no, he carries. <laughs> That's okay though. You gotta sometimes strategize, you know? And if our players strategize more, we'll win more games. Oh, look at that bouncing ring. Shake it. That double ring shit. No man. I put the gas on defense sometimes <laughs> when I want to. <laughs> it depends in practice how much I want to up the ante. I try not to up the ante too hard because, see, unlike Maverick, I'm not trying to injure my players. You know what I mean? It doesn't do me good to have injured players because it just hurts the team because. We need every guy for every position. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you. That's seven. I'll take it. Better than my last couple games. Ten. You got like what? I got 13. Oh, you got 13? Shit, I got to start playing for real. <laughs> like, oh, I gotta start getting some hoops here. And he does. Not air balls. 
That got fun. Sunshine. Oh! My bad, I missed it. I gotta try to get height on him. What's that? 18? Oh, he's kicking our asses. How can this be? Must be warming up. Oh! That's. I think that's game. Nice job. Nice job. So you guys get better to improve each game. We all do, actually. too hard on myself but if it was a game I'd be slapping my own face I'd have like nightmares that night about it <laughs> this is the stupidest thing these fucking rocks might as well just put a fence right here with a gate A little net. Can he take that? Uh, if it hits a little net, yeah, can he take that? Got hit him for take that. Okay. Just want to make sure. Because I'm so good at shit. <laughs> See? He got you on that one too. Ah. All right. It's time for me to go halt. I have to go hawk on you guys. <laughs> nice shot. There's one more person that showed. One more. Whoa. There's that slippery spot right there in one of them. Came right up there. That's a good play. <laughs> Look at that fucking ring face. And he makes it. <laughs> <laughs> Not bad for a hungover man. Not bad. I will give you credit. What do you have? Twelve? Dude, I have like zero. I missed every single three. I've hit the rim. There we go. I gotta stop on up. Oh yeah.
Yeah, usually he don't miss two of those in a row. I should know better. <laughs> nice. He's hot, he's hot. Jesus, dude, to my five. I did better in 21 the uh, last week ago, or the week before. That's all right. I'm going to devise a plan. Oh, man. Come on. Can't get any closer than that. Close. You got 18. 19, 19? 18. 18? Oh, I'm sorry, yeah, because I had 17 at 19. Yeah. What? Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. That ball's everywhere. <laughs> what do you have, James? 12. That's, that's what I got, 12, 12. And then he's got like one point away, two points away from 21. Yeah. All right. Now I know what I need to do. Not let you do that again. <laughs> Here. I always try to up the game a little bit against you guys, but not too much. I say most of my umps for the games, you know. I like there's certain teams I like to try to get a do well again. Well, I know the other coaches too.
No way. No way to get that. Found on my bad knee. I'll try though. Nice and gentle. You don't ever really force it too much, that's good. That's good to see. See, when it does shit like that, it's like, you hate it. Oh! oh. oh. Nice try. I fucked up on that. I just was like putting it up, you know? Shit bad. <laughs> he stayed on me. That's good. That's good to see. Sometimes people don't take their man when they play these things. That's all right. Oh, there it is, there it is. Oh. A little pressure, pressure. He got it. He's driving. Oh. That's why I think I got one up on him. He just pulls right. You know? That's all right, I give you time to collect your thoughts. <laughs> I don't play dirty with my team members. But they, if you're on the other team, look out. I'll play. That's the only way to really, you know, with him, with his side, you can't yeah. take the ball. He's got it, you know, solid. Nice, nice, nice. I've seen improvement from everyone. Much more improvement. But I mean, I've been, I got it the, your first game. A couple, I don't, sometimes the camera comes off, so I may only get like, you know, half game or 
Most of them I don't post. Some of them I don't post, some I do. Really good games that are close I might post. I want people to learn, but yeah, we'll run it. Nightfall, I got official. It said official on it, but I don't know. Official what? Check on me. Hey, James is a pretty good player, man. And he, he can cut to the net. He's not afraid to cut to the net. So. Yeah, he's a good cutter. I mean, and he's, he, was there, he was a new player this year. I met him in the beginning of this year, and he played in the league for four games till they cut us. And he had some pretty good games. I mean, he's a decent player, so he gets better and better, too. I think we have a pretty good team. I really do. And I think our guys practicing, and when we, when we do play, it, we'll be ready. There won't be no hesitation or anything like that. We just go out and we just do our thing. We just play basketball. Winston, if you could only fetch me the ball, I would be happy. You drink your water? No. Why aren't you drinking your water? Why aren't you drinking your water, buddy? Looks like it's poison. Good read, good read. Defense there. Turn defense to offense. That's what I do with 21. I, the way I play defense, or the way I do 21, I try to get the seven points on the free throw line. About, you know, it's hard to do, but uh -huh. about nine from outside, and then the rest, defense and air. too hard then I always miss.
defense is good, though. See, I, as a, from a, my perspective, I think if a player is defensive and offensive, that's right. That would be the type of team that I like to build. Or, you know, it's the type of team I've tried to build the last couple of years. And there were some guys that just didn't get it. Just didn't get it. Those guys never last. He already has one guy, Terrence. He's always like that, you know. Score, score, score. Maybe he worried so much about scoring, he never make anything. And then he sucked at defense because he won't play. <laughs> but I think if you are defensive, then you're one up on a lot of guys in the league. Because that's all those punks do is you're going to score. Score, you got to add to it. There we go, that's a three. You got to actually make them. Oh, man. Ready? Yeah. Holy shit, dude. I'm gonna run it again. I didn't even know you scored that much. If you work for anything in life, you can have it. I think if our team works hard, we can definitely win some of those teams. I got a bunch of teams that have been playing in Carson City, you know, 10, 15 years. So those guys don't like to lose. Because, you know, back then there was only like four teams here. And it's been increasing to six, and it went to ten, and then I think this year fourteen. So it's growing, you know. But then you get these guys like that, like for example, I joined my team. Oh, I don't like Rick as a coach. I don't like this. I don't like that. So they go start their own fucking team, you know, because they're control freaks, and they got to be in control. And and so you know, oh, I'm gonna just get my own team. I've had like five threats this year from guys. I'll get my own team. It's like good luck a lot of fucking responsibility it's not just playing with your guys and coaching you have to deal with fucking collecting money roster um if there's your guys are doing something they shouldn't you have to address it or you get in trouble like you take full ownership and responsibility for your team if i got a guy dunking they got cameras all over i don't say nothing to the guy they suspend me two games so it's like it's my ass that's what I'm saying. These guys think it's all easy because, you know, we have this guy Maverick because I really don't want you as coach because I'm an alpha and I have to control others. And it's like, it ain't about me controlling others. It's about me being a responsible team owner and making sure our team doesn't get suspended, making sure that we uh, practice, making sure funds are paid, roster set, administration work, all that stuff. It's not just, you know, oh, I'm going to control guys. It's you know, guys, can, everybody can control themselves. I'm not a control freak. If I see something wrong, I'll point it out, you know? I mean, it, it, you know, and that's a calm. Then guys get mad when you do your job as a coach. They get mad and walk, storm off and talk shit and quit and form their own teams. You know, it's like, what do you want me to say, man? I mean, you're not in uniform. I get in trouble for that. You know, and my assistant coach doesn't have to worry about that. An assistant coach in a position is just more or less, you know, they can do the same thing like, like collect ref fees from people, co coach, you know, that kind of stuff. Um, but I, because I'm the team owner, I always bear responsibility. My assistant coaches don't because they're, they're on the roster. I just, you know, name them assistant. Meaning that if I'm not there or injured or whatever, they can come talk to the assistant coach. Because I didn't, I didn't have one the last couple seasons. You know what I'm saying? Because I had guys that were like, put me on. It's, it's, it was all about, that. oh, do I get to kick guys off? It's like, why would you ask me that? You know, unless you just want to be an asshole to people. You know what I mean? And they, and they are assholes to people. And that's, that's not how I run things, you know? But you'll see. I mean, I can't wait to get to play at the map. Beautiful facility. Ah. Oh, Ooh. I broke it down. Just snapped again. Oh. On the fucking ball. Give me a second. Oh, oh when it hit the rim? Yes. Oh, man. I broke this stuff a couple of months ago. And the 
ball hit it, like hit it right here. Ooh, wow. That was painful. But yeah, the facility's really nice. And a lot of times what, what I'll do, because I used to hold practice on Sundays at the facility from one to five, four hours. And guys, some guys would show later, you know. But there's other teams down there from other the league. Sometimes they're not teams, there's guys that they pick up. And usually every Sunday it's the same guys. So we'll, you know, it takes like five of my guys and versus five of their friends. And we'll play full court games and stuff. A lot of fun. And there's no drama, nothing. You know, we'll play, we'll run it five, four or five games like that, you know. Sometimes I end up playing with teenage kids. Those are always fun. And those kids shoot better than most adults. They pass better than most adults. I play one time with nine teenagers. Every, for, for like three Sundays in a row, I was coming out playing with teenagers, you know. Just kids, just kids. And I mean, it's just working on my game, just shooting threes. You know, the kids get the rebounds, let them put it in if I miss. But yeah, it's, yeah, you know, it's a lot of fun down there. But at least on this court, I mean, this is literally our team court. Because you don't see anybody else down here playing. It's just us. At least there's no wind today. I'm probably thinking I play better in the wind. <laughs> You drink some water, boy? Huh, Winston, boy? Winston, drink your water. Drink your water. It's not poison. Drink your water. Oh my god, holy shit. How does something go in and come out like that? How? <laughs> this rim. Couple more weeks, the weather's gonna start cooling down. Oh, that one's really gonna be nice. Yeah, last year we had a, a very cool September, like some nice 75 degree weather, you know. So I'm hoping this year we get the same. But if anything, by the end of September and October, we'll have some really beautiful weather. More clouds too, so we'll have the sun in our eyes. My thumb still hurts, but it's getting better. I think I just like when the ball hit it, it's still healing. It kind of like shook it, it just sore, you know. Don't stop you. <laughs> oh, man, I knew that was going. That was a beautiful shot. There's 
no way that wasn't going. Last year, September 1st, we got a little snow on the ground. It snowed here. Yeah. Then the rest of the month was fine. Perfect weather. Not me. Fucking bored and was like, look, I'd rather have that, man. Some bored rookie bitch. You don't see the cop saying something, you see the cop. <laughs> that shit look good. Enough power kind of lost out of my hands. I gotta work on this because I always lose one or two here and there. Oh shit, I only got to 10. <laughs> you know, I'm not, believe it or not, I'm not really tired, but I'm, I get thirsty with the when the sun starts beaming. I get thirsty, you know. Me too. That's my issue. Because I'm always here to help. But Adrian's the only one getting me. He had twins, then he got all paranoid about the COVID and shit. And was like, I'm not gonna practice, I'm not gonna that's his whole reason why, because he's worried about COVID. So I have not seen him in months, but I didn't kick him off the team because that was his concern was for his children. So I'm like, okay, you know, that's fine. I mean, but he needs the most work. More or less, I think, it's just about conditioning, you know? Yeah. And as I play more and more with my teammates, I get in better condition, too. But, I mean, it takes a bit. You know, I come out here the first hour, my knee's killing me. My meds kick in, uh, I drink a lot of more fluids. I start feeling better the more I play, so more fluid. But, yeah.
this. Oh, bad is bad. Bad mange. If you do this good there, imagine what you do in the league on the foul line. <laughs> Look smashing, man. That was three in a row. Yep. That was three in a row. Well, technically four, because I made the other one. Yeah. Those are new games, so I don't have them. The last game I had ten. That's not good enough. been the perfect rebound in the league. You did just put that in. Finally, I got a three in a row on the bottom. Oh, fucking. F it's okay, Winston. I swear nobody's trying to hit you with the ball. Every time the ball goes past me, he thinks somebody's doing it on purpose to him. Like, dude, I promise we're not trying to hit you. So close. I've been getting a little better by getting my height up there with you, but it's hard to do. I'll tell you. What a shot. There you go. You're hot.
heard you went off-roading <laughs> yeah where'd you take you king's canyon up here yeah yeah it's pretty decent it's a beautiful place i used to hike there with my sons i've been all over this all these mountains now i'm getting a little old so i don't climb them as much Fourteen. Fourteen. Lucky fourteen. Good game. Oh, good game. Good game. Yeah, good game. I had played a little better. I think that's because I'm, you know, you as I play, up. I loosen up and stuff. Yeah, you warm up as the more you play. Yeah, I know. When I first started, I didn't warm up.